It's the funniest thing. Jimmy Ward missed the game against the Patriots, and the 49ers defense improved. How did that happen? Maybe it's because Jimmy Ward is overrated. Or maybe it's because his backup, Tavarius Moore, is just really freaking good. You make the call. Here's Moore playing free safety. It's 7.56 in the first quarter. It's third and four. He's going to make a play here. You almost never see Jimmy Ward make a play. He plays a very conservative style of football. He's around the ball. He gets there a beat late, makes the tackle. Tavarius Moore gets there on time. Here, he reads the quarterback's eyes, sees that he's going to check it down to the running back almost before the, the quarterback sees that he's going to check it down. Sprints over there, does not slow down at contact, delivers a big hit, and gets the stop in front of the first down marker on third and four. Watch it again. Watch how quickly he reacts, the instincts, the closing speed, and the contact courage. Boom, that's a big hit. Here's another play Tavarius Moore made. This time there's six seconds left in the first quarter, and it's third and six at the 49ers 22, just outside the red zone. Tavarius Moore is up here. It looks like he's playing free safety right now. The strong safeties, Marcel Harris is closer to the line of scrimmage, but they're disguising their coverage. He's going to back out, and Moore's going to drop down. It's cover one, uh, meaning man-to-man -man with a single safety high and an underneath zone defender. You call it a robber, a rat defender. Uh, we'll call it a robber. That's going to be Tavarius Moore. He's disguising it now. Now he's starting to creep up. He drops down right here. Everyone else is in man-to-man -man coverage. He's waiting for this crossing route. Really well scouted by Robert Sala. He knows exactly what's coming. The defense is in great position. But Tavarius Moore, you're going to make this hit. You're built like a cornerback. You were drafted to play cornerback. You're now playing strong safety on this play. What do you got? Third and six. You got to make this hit. Watch it. Not only does he make the hit in front of the first down marker like the last time, he knocks and kill Harry out of the game. Watch it in full, in full speed. He doesn't hit like a corner. He hits like a strong safety. Zero contact fear. Doesn't slow down at all. Look at this. Look at that. Then he flexes in his face. 14-32, third quarter, second and three at the Patriots' 34-yard line. Tavarius Moore is playing deep here. 15, 16 yards off the line of scrimmage. And remember, the question about him is tackling. The angles he takes to ball carriers and his ability to tackle because he's built like a cornerback. And he missed some tackles last season. But look at him here. The last line of defense. No hesitation. Creams the running back. Doesn't catch the running back. Remember Eric Reed when he was the Niners free safety after a couple of concussions? That guy was making business decisions. If a running back ran up on him like this, he would stop in his tracks and try to catch him like the running back was a ground ball. Tavarius Moore runs, meets him head on at the same speed the running back's running. Let's watch it full speed. No fear. Boom. Watch it from the end zone. Full speed. This, this is safety, folks. That's a hitter. Last one. This time it's 527 in the third quarter. First and 10 at the 49ers 37-yard line. This time, Tavarius Moore is just lined up at strong safety. I mean, right next to Dre Greenlaw and Fred Warner. He's basically playing linebacker. The Patriots are going to run the ball, and number 16 is supposed to block Tavarius Moore. Let's see what happens. Moore reads it, and he fires what coaches would say downhill quickly before the other linebackers do and before this wide receiver can get out and block him. He sees the lane of the ball carrier. He doesn't hesitate. He explodes into the backfield. And he makes the tackle. Remember, tackling is supposed to be Tavarius Moore's weakness. He's supposed to not be able to play strong safety. He's supposed to be limited. Is he limited? Does this look like a weakness to you? Remember, his strength is in coverage. He's a playmaker when he goes against teams that actually throw the ball, unlike the Patriots. Watch what he does this Sunday against the Seahawks, if he starts.